Welcome back. Today we're going to do a simple barbecue recipe and I call it Alex's birthday chicken because it's my daughter Alex's favorite recipe. Um, the grill is on high. It's all heated up and what I've got here is I've got um, a little paper towel and I'm soaking it in a little bit of peanut oil. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to oil up the grates just like this. And what we'll do is we'll start off by putting the chicken on and as the chicken is cooking I will explain to you how I prepared it. So we're going to use boneless chicken thighs and I like to use chicken thighs because they cook very quickly, they're cut thin, and they tend not to dry out. So we'll just put those on the hot grill. Okay. And these will cook very quickly, probably in two minutes or so per side. So the way we're going to prepare our marinade is we have basically it's an it's a very simple recipe. There's equal parts of soy sauce, ketchup, and honey. And what we'll do is we'll put these right into a Ziploc bag. So I'm going to put about a tablespoon of each and you can adjust this according to your the, the amount of chicken that you're cooking. I'm going to be cooking up two thighs. So there we go. And if you want a little bit of smoky flavor you can use a little bit of sesame oil. Probably just a teaspoon of that. Not, not equal parts, just a little bit. And then what we'll do is we'll take our chicken, which has been thawed. We'll put that right into the Ziploc, push the air out, and we'll seal it up. So let's check on the chicken thighs. And I think they're cooking up quite nicely. Put that over. Put that over. Here we go. I'm going to put these over here so I'll be able to add the other chicken when it's time. And so, what you can do with this, this is actually a great way to marinate meats, is you just massage it around in the bag, probably, you know, for a minute or so. And um, done at room temperature, this really speeds the marinating process up. Make sure that everything is covered up. You can think of the meat as kind of a sponge. And when you do this, just as with a sponge, you're getting that marinade well mixed into the surface of the meat. So there we go. And so now we are at the point where we started today's video. The chicken is ready to cook. And we'll take a look at this. And I'll just cut into this just to make sure it's cooked. And there you have it. It's completely cooked through because it's so thin.
And here we are. Alex's birthday chicken. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you next time.